You want to know, I suppose. You want to turn a nice little girl like me into a cold-blooded murderer. You want to know why I did it? Why I killed all of those girls? It's because I like it. I don't expect you to understand what it's like. You have no idea to hold someone's life in your hands and your control. There's always that moment of acknowledgement between a killer and her victim, that moment when she realizes your power. She looks you in the eyes and you look back at her and she pleads for mercy for her life. And you have a split second to decide to save her. Well, that's nice. You could give her back to her family, her friends, the people that love her. Or you can kill her. Remove her from this earth. Take away the thing that most value above all else, her life. None of them deserve their lives. Look at them. The actor, the writer, the dancer, the musician, the model. They were the best, and that meant nothing to them. I have never been the best. Always smart, but never the smartest. Pretty, but never the prettiest. Talented, but never the most talented. But despite all this, I always thought I was special, that there was something lurking inside of me that would make me great. I was never okay with the idea of just living my life, dying and being forgotten. No, that's just not me. I want to be remembered for my achievements. And I will, won't I? Sure. You're disgusted by what I've done. You're horrified. You think I'm some sort of monster. But I can guarantee that you're not going to go home to your boring little life and just forget about me. No, I'm willing to bet that I'll be on your mind for quite some time. I used to think that there's other ways that I could be recognized. I, I thought that I could be famous. And then I realized how stupid that was. People would want to be me without really knowing what that means. And then, get this, I thought I could be a lawyer. Me. I thought if I save lives, people will worship me. Then I realized saving people isn't enough. I can save a hundred people's lives, and they'd be grateful, so would their family and friends. But what about everyone else? They'd see me on the news and think, huh, that's nice, and then change the channel and move on to something else. killed just one person, and not just kill them, brutally murder them with my bare hands looking straight into their eyes. Not for revenge, not for personal gain, just because I like killing. Well, then everyone would pay attention. The whole world would stop, and I would be standing there in the center with everyone looking at me. I know what you're all thinking. I can see it by the looks in your faces. You think I'm just some attention-seeking little kid. Well, I'm not. I just wanted someone to notice me. I have always been in the background my entire life. There's always been that one student that gets higher grades than me, that one friend who always shuts me down, and that teacher who makes me feel stupid, that parent that's not interested, and that sibling who overshadows all of my achievements with theirs. And no one cares. I just want you to think. I want you to think the next time that you plan on putting someone down, pointing out their faults, making them feel stupid, belittling them. I want you to think about me. Then think about them and what they can do to you. How much would you respect them if they had their hands wrapped around your neck and they had the choice to release their grip from your throat? Think about it.